I once said on a radio show, I think, that pornography may serve a rational purpose. Um, and it was in the context of the desirability of variety in a sexual relationship. You know, time and place and clothes, et cetera, et cetera. I said one possibility is people can watch certain kinds of uh, movies. Now, I basically said it to shock objectivist Puritans because there are a lot of objectivists who are very staid and withdrawn uh, in regard to sex, which, uh, you know, you do what you can to shake them up, but it's very hard to do so. <laughs> but now the questioner goes on, I believe that entering into pornography <clears throat> as an actor, director, etc., is irrational. If you agree with the last, aren't you guilty of a contradiction? Can, can it be rational to patronize that which you know requires irrationality? I, I think that's, it certainly stopped me uh, as a very good question. And I'll tell you, the best that I can come up with is <laughs> can, can there not be people who engage in that as an occasional sideline as against a career or uh, desperately need money or um, see it as an exercise in acting or maybe they're a loving couple and they don't mind being uh, photographed. I mean, if I met somebody who engaged in that, I wouldn't automatically recoil, uh, although it's hard to say why. Um, uh, I'm not sure I would even give that uh, advice now, but um, I, I don't have a, a real answer. Maybe I was just wrong about that, or maybe there are people who can treat pornography so, I mean, you know, certain kinds, because there's a lot of pornography that's horrible, but uh, people that can treat it so professionally that they're not touched by it. And it's like an actress working in today's movie, you know, where she takes all her clothes off. Of course, this is a little more, well, not much more than what you see today. I, I basically saw that in, uh, in uh, New York, where I just was in Equus, where the guy, Harry Potter, or whatever his real name is, took his clothes off and was doing something on the stage with uh, an actress who also had no clothes on. So, I mean, is that pornography? That's high art. It cost a fortune. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I, I, uh, I will have to c concede to this person that I guess I don't have. Do you want to add something to that? <laughs> I think I'll let you have that. What's the question, okay. about, what's the question about viewing pornography or performing? No, performing. performing. Well, oh, we have all that? Okay. Yeah. I mean, there are cases, I think, where there are couples that engage in pornography. So, I mean, you know, that's so. They engage no, in? No, no, but I mean, they, no, the, the actors are actually oh. together in real life. And does, does that, does that help know. you? I don't know. It helps you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I think I'm going to leave this one, lose this one. I just wanted to show that I was honest, you know, so sometimes if I get totally trapped, I have to mumble something. I, I see I could easily just have not answered that, just throwing it out, who would know? <laughs>